It's a busy day at the airport, but the traffic flow is going smoothly. Blue Jet 337 is taxiing along the parallel taxiway for an intersection departure from runway 07. Red Jet 56 Alpha is on approach to the same runway. Meanwhile, the controller clears Yellow Jet for takeoff. As Blue Jet 337 is taxiing to the holding point, the tower controller asks the crew, Blue Jet 337, are you ready for immediate departure? Airbus 320, 5 miles from touchdown. They respond, ready, Blue Jet 337 and the controller issues the clearance. Next, she advises Red Jet 56 Alpha to expect a late landing clearance. Another departure demands her attention. When the controller turns back to Blue Jet 337, she notices that the aircraft is stationary at the intersection departure position. The controller waits a few seconds for the aircraft to start rolling when Red Jet 56 Alpha reports Tower, Red Jet 56 Alpha going around do traffic on the runway. The controller has no option but to cancel Blue Jet 337's takeoff clearance. What went wrong? To expedite traffic, clearance for immediate takeoff can be issued to an aircraft before it enters the runway. Once accepted by the pilot, the controller will expect the aircraft to taxi onto the runway and take off in one continuous movement. But in this case, the pilot was not able to do so. This made an airborne conflict likely and increased the workload for everyone involved. To avoid these situations, pilots and controllers should remember these key points. Pilots, never request or accept an immediate departure clearance if unsure that you will be able to begin takeoff without stopping. Ensure that the cabin secure report has been received before accepting an immediate departure. If you become aware that additional time on the runway is required for operational reasons, notify the controller as soon as possible. Controllers Use immediate departure clearances only when the aircraft is at the cleared holding point or is approaching it with no traffic in front. Before issuing the clearance, check with the flight crew to make sure they are able to accept it. Inform them of the reason. Immediate departure from an intersection may not be possible due to aircraft performance or wake turbulence limitations or other cockpit-related factors. Closely monitor pilots' conformance with immediate departure clearances and be ready with an alternative plan. Learn more about immediate departure clearances on Skybrae.